Hey yo, my planet coaster friends, Johnny5 Alive here. We're back with another episode of Park Spotlight. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at City Slickers Park created by Red Dragon. So stay tuned and let's check it out. All right, this was sent in by one of our Discord master builders, Red Dragon, and also Silver Patrons. Thank you so much for your support, Red Dragon. You are helping to keep the show go on, and I really appreciate that. So he sent this in and says, Hi, Johnny. This is Red Red again. This time I went all out and built a park. There was a lot more I wanted to build, but had to stop because of the frame rates. Said so. <laughs> Everything on this map was built by me solely, in except for the Taj Mahal was built by Tura Blue, my son the building was also the building was so awesome i had to use it the park consists of two coasters two boomerang coasters and two track rides plus some flat rides to enhance the park there are three animated blueprints on this park that i think you will enjoy the damn lighthouse and railroad the lighthouse and railroad are the best viewed at night hope you enjoy and people find good use for new builds all right Quick look at the Steam Workshop, everybody. City Slickers Park by Red Dragon. Come over here. Let's get it some more ratings. Come rate it, favorite it, subscribe to it. Links will be down in the description as always. All right, let's check this out. All right away, I can tell there's some cool Red Dragon vehicles. He's the master builder at vehicles. Absolutely amazing. Now, he was saying that there were some frame rates. I had to drop it to medium graphics, so I'm still getting about 20 FPS. Um, and I'm going to assume it's because of these vehicles. These vehicles... 2,000 objects for one of those vehicles. That is absolutely insane. All the micro details uh, Red Dragon does is really crazy and that'll do it. So let's take an overarching look at this city. All right, very cool. Airport with nice little planes, all his army vehicles. Awesome. Oh, look at those. That is amazing. Holy moly. Great spot for that flat ride. Oh, look at this. So much detail gone into this. Oh, look at these yachts. My goodness, yeah, uh, links to Red Dragon's workshop will also be in the description if you guys are looking for some insanely detailed and crafty vehicles, he is certainly the go-to person for that. He's the master builder in vehicles of all types, boats, cars, airplanes, you name it, he's got it. I really can't wait for them to add uh, rowboat rides in. I really wish that was in the summer update, but what can you do? Uh, I think it would have been a great addition to the game. Fire trucks. Look at that. That's insane. Fire station. Oh, there's a little ride in there. That is beautiful. Tons of pieces. That that crown is fifteen hundred pieces. Oh my goodness! Now he said everything in this park was built from himself, except for I think this. So if you guys are looking for some skyscrapers, some buildings, and all that stuff, you can find it on his workshop as well. Nice little dam over here. That's wicked. Oh look, there's an airplane. Holy moly. Yeah, no wonder the frames are dipping, because <laughs> these tiny little things take up so many pieces, it's crazy. Oh, there's a helicopter up here. I gotta keep looking at the really closely because I know I'm gonna miss something. The bees have bows. This is so cute. Uh, ah, the food truck. Uh, that's incredible. 
really impressive details. What is this? <laughs> oh. Big old toilet. This go kart track. Oh wait, that's a go kart track. Yes, it is. This looks exciting. I I can't wait to race that. All right, there's a look at it all, everybody. How about we ride some coasters? I'm gonna start off with the go-karts in this one. So, here we go. It's called the Speed One, 8.08 .08 Excitement, 4.2 Fear, and a 1.9 Nausea. We're gonna call it Bollard, so we can race these. We're gonna jump into the last car. Oh no! I couldn't quite get the last car. Okay. All right. Time to race. I'm in control. Oh. Oh, oh boy. It's gonna be tight. No! What? What just happened? Oh! Beat it! Come on, get through here. Oh, it's gonna be a tight squeeze. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Later. All right, now we just gotta maintain our lead. Oh, look at that. The ring. Oh, that's perfect. Love the fire effect on that too. Custom supports going up the side, or is that custom? I think that's, might be. It's only on one side. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, and the game blows up. Uh, not good. I can't see what's happening. Woo! Winner! Watch over the pigeon! Awesome. Alright, that was a lot of fun. The Barghest. 6.25 excitement, 4.89 fear, and a 1.5 nausea. Got one leaving right now. Five excitement, two point four fear, and a one nausea. Now, where's the boarding station for this? This goes around the whole park. Oh my god, I'm not sure where the boarding station is. Okay, here it is. Meet me. Oh, look at that. Oh, these vehicles. Okay, well, we're gonna go on two times speed for this since it is quite the long track ride. We get a good look at some of the uh, vehicles as we pass by. A sailboat. Police boat as well. Oh, it's shooting at us. This is cool. Oh. Settle down. Some great views. And she's sitting in the passenger seat. <laughs> That's weird.
Now, if you guys did not see Red Dragon's Farmer Nightmare, Farmer's Nightmare, uh, type it into the search engine on my ch video channel, or the videos, this video search on my channel, and uh, go check out the Farmer's Nightmare. It was one of the most unique parks I've seen. Um, he did a little tour through a farmer's land. There's crops, there's little animals, you name it, he's got it in there. And I thought it was a lot of fun. And I think it was the first video I did when I got my GTX 1080 Ti. And, uh, yeah, it's a great creation. So, another one from Red Dragon. Something's going on in that building. Must be a flat ride. It's really loud. Big crane. Oh, train crossing. That's great. All right, another coaster, test flight. 7.1 excitement, 5.6 fear, and a 2.9 nausea. Here's the results if you want to see them. Boot Camp, 6.6 .6 excitement, 6.3 fear, and a 3.6 nausea. There's the results, and it's a giant inverted boomerang. Wicked. I love the colors on this too. Perfect boot camp. Good theming. Sped up. Nope, that was regular speed. Felt like I was going fast. Amazing. A lot of fun details in here, Red Dragon. Absolutely love your vehicle work. The park was a lot of fun. And some great views on that track ride as well. So really good job on this, Red Dragon. Can't wait to see what you do next with your vehicles. Maybe um, maybe you could do um, a, a small park coaster dedicated to all your vehicle blueprints or something like that try and get an homage of everything jammed in there uh, this is kind of a, a good display of all your vehicles though in in a park form oh you know what there's a uh, train choo choo let's do it
Oh, look at this. I would have completely missed this. Oh my god! One thing I'm curious about in this game with the AI, do they have the option to stay on the train till the next stop? Or do they all get off? I've never really uh, tested that. Because I'm curious if some people... Yeah. You would think that they would stay on. Just wondering if it forces them to get off. That train crossing here. Oh no! <laughs> Some beautiful details in here, Red Dragon. I love it. There it is. All right. I knew I was missing something. There you go. That was uh, City Slickers Park by Red Dragon, everybody. And that's going to do it for this episode of Park Spotlight. If you guys enjoyed, please be sure to smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe for more daily Planet Coaster videos. If you guys want to support the show and keep it going, you can do so by becoming a patron or by leaving a tip or donation using the links down in the description below. All right, everybody. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye now.